Hi, this is Preeti. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are staying safe and doing well and also keeping up with your beauty routine since today's video is super, super interesting and I'm going to show you five things or five must-have essentials in your grooming kit. Now, if you look at this kit, this particular kit is actually stitched by my granny. And in fact, all of my toiletries, all of my any essentials, I have about 10 of these and I store in them. Maybe you'll see them in my other vlogs and videos later on. So getting back to the topic, let's begin. essential in my grooming kit is this soft nail brush. This is super important to me as it serves the purpose of keeping your nails clean and this is so small, so handy, it can be placed anywhere and it's so important for three reasons. Number one, since I'm a new mom and I take care of Taksh with my bare hands, right? I feed him, I change his diapers, I apply cream to him, I remove stuff from his mouth when he stuffs it in. So for all of those, it is very important for me to keep my nails clean. So this is very essential. Second reason, it's very important to maintain your nail hygiene because we often touch our face, we touch our hair and all of that gunk can settle on your skin and if that happens, it can lead to acne and a lot of other things. So again, if you want healthy skin, then take care of your nails. And the third reason is just for hygiene purpose. Have you seen when whenever I see people with like really bad like dirty nails it gives off the first thought that comes in your mind is how unhygienic like I just I hate that I think you have to wash your hands often you have to groom it you cannot have gunk under your nails especially as an adult so the next product in my grooming kit is this <laughs> Can you guys guess what this is? This is actually a facial hair remover. This is the one by Philips. This is their Philips Cordless Facial Hair Remover. As many of you already know, I am quite hairy and I have a lot of facial hair. So facial hair remover is a big part of my grooming routine. And since I do a lot of shoots and I'm in front of a camera quite a bit, I have to wear makeup and everything. So the skin under my makeup for it to sit right must be even and you know, free of any peach fuzz that I have all over my face. And this product is absolutely perfect to give me a smooth, bare skin before I put makeup on. All you have to do is just switch it on and it removes and just roll it on your face and it removes the finest of the finest hair on my upper lips, chin and my cheeks and everywhere else. I love this product. It is so handy. You don't need water. You don't need anything. All you have to do is just roll it and it's, it's perfect. With its wide round head, this trimmer offers maximum coverage to remove facial hair. The best part about this facial hair removal product is that it is gentle on the skin and does not cause any rash or irritation. See how easily it works on the face, gliding and removing unwanted hair. Used it for the first time for upper hair removal and this facial hair remover has built-in mirror, LED light, both of which help improve visibility to ensure you don't miss out on a single hair. Also, it is super compact, lightweight, so I can carry it anywhere for a quick touch-up on the go. And the third product in my grooming kit is this two-in-one foot callus remover. So this I usually use it once or twice a week whenever there's like dead skin built up and I use this in the shower. It is perfect for those people who love home pedicures. So I always use this like scrub your heels. This stands up removing your dead skin cells, all the calluses, all the built up and keeps your feet like really clean. I think I'm really obsessed with keeping my nails and my feet clean although I'm not uh, more of a nail polish person. I think you've rarely seen me with nail polish, but I do like keeping them, you know, very hygienic and very clean. And the fourth product in my grooming kit is this. <laughs> this is an exfoliating glove. I use it every day in the shower. I have two, three of these. Don't worry. That's why this is so clean. So I take the shower gel, I spray it on this and then I use it. This is very, very soft. It's not rough at all. And if at all, I want to do some extra exfoliation, then I just turn it around and this is 
it's still soft but it's good for exfoliation so i use this part on my hands and legs to remove the dead skin so that you know especially if you have dead skin right what happens you get a lot of ingrown hair and everything so it's very important to exfoliate your hands and legs and your skin especially to avoid ingrown hair for us hairy women <laughs> So the fifth product in my grooming kit is this pure coconut oil. Don't worry, I don't keep this whole bottle in my grooming kit. I have a small glass next to my sink in my washroom. So that's why I use and if you're wondering what I do with this is I do oil pulling. So the idea behind oil pulling is the oil binds to and attracts toxins, bacteria and other impurities that have accumulated in your mouth. And this is the first thing that you're supposed to do after you wake up. And this is a fairly recent thing that I've started. It's a very Ayurvedic thing. And I started I think after I saw a post of Anushka Sharma doing it. <laughs> that's when I did a little bit of research and I was like why not let's try it and it's worked pretty well I really now it's like you know it's more of a habit I really enjoy it and I do feel that my dental hygiene has improved after I've started doing oil pulling if you guys would like I can do a whole separate video on oil pulling like my research back videos I can do all of that and I can show you but for today I hope you enjoyed this short and sweet video don't forget to check out the Philips hair remover I will drop the link in the description box below it's available on Amazon and with that we've come to the end of this video don't forget to like share subscribe I'll see you soon bye